Here's my multi-line argon ion laser. Just got it from Dagwin on uh, LPF. Got a little jumper up to run. I haven't yet built the uh, remote for it yet, but uh, I managed to pull up the schematic and get it running. After trying unsuccessfully for about seven hours to get it running, based off schematics from uh, LaserFact, I went delving into the net to find actual schematics, and here it is. It works. Apparently, there's a lot of errors on there, or this unit um, was configured uh, stock, and other ones aren't. Anyway, little uh, 120, 240 step up auto transformer running the swirl cage fan. You can see the head there lazing beautifully. Combined 8 line beam there into a uh, 90 degree mirror. It's a prism. Uh, this prism doesn't work great for uh, actually diffracting, so I have it going into a little 500 line uh, diffraction grating. You can see the lines splitting off there. And around back. Camera doesn't do it justice, and uh, I'm going to put a little more fog in the air and turn off the lights in a moment. But until then, and you can see my CO2 sitting back there. Right now I have it running at 8 amps. A little higher than standard run, but I'm not going to push it too hard. She's doing fine still. A little more fog. Let's kill the lights. Here's the primary split beam. The yeah, combined beam is showing up white on my camera, but it, it isn't the eye. Bumped into my tripod. So you can see I did a safety check already with it on low power, idling, make sure that all the beams are well more than a foot and a half lower than high level. Even all the little stray ones terminating up on the wall. No goggles on right now. So I don't have a pair that will cover all these wavelengths. But it's only 80 milliwatts anyway. I'm not running all that much yet. But I'm quite happy with it. There's not nearly as much saturation and bloom to the eye. The uh, camera makes it much worse. That's just a reflection off a picture frame.
Thanks for watching. Hopefully tomorrow I'll have the remote built up and uh, be able to do this thing a lot more easily than all those mess of wires there. Future reference for anyone who's watching, this is a Two one one four P dash four zero MLA argon ion unit. You cannot use pin twenty five, twenty four, twenty two, twenty one, twenty, twenty three, or ten as you return ground pins. They don't work. You have to use pin eleven only. That's the error that caused seven hours of headache. Anyway, thanks for watching. Later.